by the time we get more sophisticated with it, we'll probably be using like JSON and stuff. So, yeah, for now, uh, uh, so now with, uh, oh, wait, yeah, no, yeah, no, I don't have to, uh, <laughs> wait, open, oh, oh, interesting. Wait, so if I just say, so, huh, uh, oh, so I need, like, the file, I need the concept of the file either way, so I'll just say, wait, what the heck is a file? I mean, like, what is, what the heck is F in this case? I just make up a name for it, I guess. I will always be, I, well, actually, that's not 100% true. I won't literally always be shirtless, but if you, <laughs> I'm a fairly reliable source of shirtlessness. So wait, does it, I don't understand what, where F comes from, so I'm just gonna, yeah, but like, do I just make it up on the spot? Oh, yeah, but I'm not trying to open anything. I'm not, I'm just trying to, like, plop out a file. So, all right, I'll, fig I'll figure it out. Um, I'm not opening anything, I swear. I swear to you, I'm not opening anything. So maybe that's just, like, weird syntax where I have to pretend I'm opening something. Um, but I swear to you, I'm not opening anything. I'm not opening a single thing. Not a single thing. Um. Oh, yeah, okay, so that's what I was, was going to look up, I guess. All right, so that's... <laughs> whatever, I don't care. So, um, so, all right, so with, uh, <laughs> thank you for clarifying. It's just, it's just one of those things that, like, I'm sure once I've learned it, it'll be fine, and I'll just keep typing it, but the, the, it's, you know, those things when you learn them, they don't make any sense, and you can't help but consider them to be, like, vaguely dumb. <laughs> um, so, so do I open it based on its file path, then? Uh, I guess, uh, W, wait, did we, we have W in quotes, uh, with W open as, uh, et cetera, as, a uh, P data, I guess, whatever, I don't care. Uh, P data, P data dot write, uh, P dict D key, or string P dict D key. Maybe? I don't know. I wonder if that'll work. No? Are you mad about something? Which is invalid syntax here. Oh, interesting. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, so, I don't know. I, like, if I, when I name things, I, I would name that, um, I would name that, like, like, I don't know, open or create. Because, like, we're not opening anything. We're legit not opening anything. But whatever. I mean, it's cool that open acts as open or create because that is a convenient thing for things to do. I just I don't know. Uh, oh, I, I don't have enough. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I should just I should just type a key. Wait twenty seconds. You guys can validate it for me. <laughs> no, I um I don't know. Maybe this just works now. I mean, the one thing that we don't do that we might want to do at some point, especially if we plan on, uh, it might not matter, but like, um, you know, pres well, actually, yeah, I guess the other thing I could do is I could, um, instead of saving, like, well, no, I should, I should save, I should save frequently, but, um, so I get chat messages when someone leaves the, no, wait, I get chat messages when someone joins the channel. I don't know if I get, uh. Uh, uh, no, wait, <laughs> that one says left, well, because <laughs> someone was issuing the command left. Uh, 
Is it? Um, hmm. Oh, there's a... There's the channel pinging. I still don't do anything with that. I wonder if that's a problem. Uh... Yeah, but if like if I was if open was addressing the cabinet, then that would make sense. But it's not. Open is addressing the file in the cabinet. So, um, and actually, that's not true because I I actually went to the store. I bought a Manila folder, and I'm writing in the Manila folder that I just bought from the store. And only once I'm done writing in it, and I'm going to put it in the cabinet at all. So, boom. Um, <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> I, I I really need to emphasize how appreciative I am of, of your guys' help, because it would actually just take me a lot longer if I had to look all this stuff up, up online. So I, I do really appreciate that. And I don't mean to I don't mean to sound like I'm... I, I criticize things that I find suboptimal, um, which isn't necessarily a great habit, but, like, I maintain it. I, like... It's better than a... I don't know. I, like, I don't want to, like... What's the what's the what's the analogy of like the monkey house like? I don't, I don't remember what it is, but basically the gist is like if you get used to something that doesn't make sense, like you're actually like devaluing like your core like design principles. So like, I don't want to do that. I <laughs> I want things to get better, and things are actually only going to get better. Like not I'm not saying like we have to rewrite Python right now, but like I just uh like uh yeah. But again, I'm not addressing the cabinet, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm addressing the file. Um, so, uh, uh, um, what was I, yeah, I guess I was gonna take a, st I was gonna check out stats and then, uh, and then, uh, oh, wait, can I even, yeah, pedicts. Oh, I can't, I can't expand it. Oh, no, I can. Okay, cool. <laughs> so, Light Up Man and Rust Jr. each have six points. So, if I did this correctly, then, uh, uh, was it Projects, Journey, there should be a subfolder. Do I need, like, uh, do I need, like, underscore, underscore, init, underscore, underscore, dot pi in order for, uh, actually, you know what, I'm going to try running it first. <laughs> So I'm gonna shut down the bot. I'm gonna restart the bot. And so it was. Wait, what were the, what were the scores again? I'll uh, I'll keep note of this. So Russ Jr. and Light Up Man each had six points. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Russ uh, Jr. six. Light Up Man six. Alright. Um. <laughs> so, but yeah, before I do that, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let it create the files first to see uh, see how that all goes. All right, so the bot shut down, uh, bot down, uh, and then I'll put it back up again, I guess. Uh, is that your bot talking, Light Up Man? Or are you actually asking what time it is? Because <laughs> right now it's 4.13 where I am. All right, so let's, uh, let's run the bot and look at the file system, I guess. Uh, tower... Oh yeah, here, I'll, uh, I'll link the, uh, so yeah, the bot's back up again, and now it might actually save stuff, or it might just, like, get to a weird error, I guess we'll find out, in the very near future. Uh, uh, survey says, So one of the things I also have to implement in the future is like kind of like a, sorry, the timing's really long. Uh, it's still 60 seconds, or 60 units, whatever 60 time units is. Oh. <laughs> um, uh, so, uh, what's the bot doing? Is it? So is it like, oh, okay, well there's that. Uh, No such what? Wait, which line are you? Two sixteen. 
Lies. Lies. All right, fine, I won't just stomp it every freaking time. Or I will. I don't know. <laughs> um. E how? Oh, is that the problem? All right. It can create. It can create files. It just can't create directories. Uh, sure. All right. Uh, let's try this again. Uh, <laughs> I should I should probably randomize it so it doesn't always start with the boulder, but whatever. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> it's actually really fortuitous that you're here. I swear this project would uh, probably take like at least like I don't know a significant chunk longer if you if you just weren't here. I can give you like a producer credit <laughs> or like a, an engineer credit if you want. Um. Uh, oh right, yeah, I can play along too, why not? Uh, cower. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, what? Still don't like that? Did I not save it? No, I saved it. No such file or directory. Players. Edge future. Wait, why edge future? Oh, because edge future. <laughs> Input a command. Right. Uh, <laughs> um, weird. Oh, is it trying to make a directory? Because I don't want it to make a directory. I just want it to make, like, a file. So do I have to, like, add the file extension? Or... how I mean I don't have anything against it W plus what's W plus that sounds fancy uh, okay what's W plus <laughs> Um, all right, so, yeah. Um. Oh, sorry, I forgot to say about down. But whatever. All right. All right, take three. Uh, I guess I could have lowered the time limit again, but whatever. Uh, alright. Uh, left. Huzzah! Teamwork! Edge future, you iconoclast. <laughs> you always can change your, you always can change your vote as well. So, for example, I could go right. Which, actually, I don't know if I test that very often, so. Now light up man bot too. Ha ha ha. <laughs> I mean, it's, uh. It's uh This isn't this is 
Yeah, no, technically, yeah, this, uh, this is more, uh, technically the bot won't get as many points, I don't think. I think the bot only gets one point, and we'll get two points, hypothetically. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you'll, uh, if you have a way to game that, uh, I guess, yeah, that, that would be pretty easy to game with bots, you just, uh, oh, uh, I was just, um, oh, what? No such... <sighs> Liars. Liars. Uh... <laughs> uh... Weird. Um... So... Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's weird. One of the examples I looked at had the leading, the leading, uh, the leading slash. I should I should drop down the uh, test time just so that. Alright, uh, save that. Oh, was I reading an example from Linux? Whoops. <laughs> it's usually the internet. Or. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, uh, <laughs> we're gaming your bot light up, man. <laughs> we're making your, your bot choose the less preferred option. <laughs> oh. I want backslashes. Interesting. Well, it didn't crash, so that's good. Is it actually making data? Hey, look, it's actually making data. Hey, look, it's actually making data. All right, so that's cool. I'm gonna shut down the bot uh, again and change the timing. Oops. Uh, uh, Cause it's actually, oh yeah, so for one thing it's actually working and for another thing, I owe Russ Jr. and uh, Light up, man. Uh, six points. <laughs> so, uh, light up, man. And, uh, uh, new text document, uh, Russ Jr. 08. Is it? Yeah. Uh, so these should both be six. All right. Oh, cool. <laughs> we did it, you guys. Boom. Uh, <laughs> yeah, CP fourteen fourteen is, uh, I might be the, uh, whoops, hold on, maybe. I'm taking the bot back down for a second. It might have printed something. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, I'm putting this back up to 60. Uh, all right, cool. Uh, I might be the guy running the show, but, uh, CP1414 and Ames X David are the, uh, the brains behind this operation. <laughs> um, all right. So, yeah, th that actually... Well, no, just because of you guys, that did not take nearly as many time, nearly as much time as it would have. Like, I would have been working on that for at least another hour, if not for your guys' help. So, thank you. <laughs> um, uh, let's see. Yeah, so I'm thinking I might do art next. Uh, so, I guess Pi Game, I should probably... I forget if I installed that. Did I install that already? Yeah, probably. Uh, I don't even know what that means. Uh, one day one of these links is going to be like porn, and I'm just going to click it anyways. <laughs> and I apologize in advance for when that happens. <laughs> oh man, I don't know if you guys are watching at 4 in the morning on Sunday morning, but uh, someone in chat 
Cookie Monster. No, like something. I call him Cookie Monster because he's a monster and his his name had Cookie in it somewhere. Um, posted a link to just a, a an image of a clown, and just there's a screaming noise in the background, and there's just this there's this flashing image of a clown. It was terrifying. It was in four in the morning, so it starts screaming really loud. My speakers weren't up that loud, but it was just like so loud. And then I start yelling because like that freaks me right the hell out. And I have like four room I have like three roommates, so like I'm sure I woke all of them up. They haven't kicked me out of that house yet, but <laughs> so that's good. But uh This reminds me of like Super Meat Boy a little bit. But uh Were you there at Treacher? I forget. That whole night was like kind of a blur. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so yeah, Cookie Monster is banned. <laughs> um this is cool. Uh, is this also in hacks? Or, um, wait, did you say? A new engine. Wow, cool. That's, uh, a <laughs> That is way more pleasant than the, um, than the terrifying clown. <laughs> Infinitely times more pleasant. Um, oh no, did we, we had another, we had another error? Wait a second. No such file or directory. Players HP. Yeah, it definitely does exist. Oh, yeah, alright. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's weird, because Edge Future definitely does exist. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's definitely in the archive. Actually, I can dig it up. It wouldn't be, it didn't take that long to find. I'll do it, I'll do it, uh, I'll do it later. But yeah, that, that was a highlight. No, it was like the opposite of a highlight. It was definitely a low light. What was the other thing that, um... So yeah, that seems cool. That seems like a cool thing to do. Um... So CB1414 suggested double backslash. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, it seems weird that it's not working this time, although it worked last time. I guess this is the case where the file already existed. So it seemed to work fine when the file didn't exist yet, but now that the file exists, it's like... Why would I get a no such file or directory error if the file does already exist? Shouldn't I... Oh, wait. Did I forget to... It's, it doesn't say t .txt. Did I forget to... Did I forget a reference to... .txt? Yeah, I totally did, didn't I? Yep, that's all. Alright. We almost got this, you guys. Almost. In fact, this could be it, probably. Or, yeah, that should be good. Uh... Cool. Alright, so let's run the bot one more time. For reals this time. Maybe? I don't know. Uh, so the boulder once more, right? The boulder? The boulder? Uh, so, uh, right, I guess. Uh, yeah. But yeah, so I just forgot. I was just sloppy with my naming conventions. But I think it'll probably work now. I assume. I don't know. Maybe it won't. We'll find out. <laughs> uh, it'd be nice if it did, because I kind of want to move on to the next thing. I mean, I always want to move on to the next thing. It's just who I am as a person. Yeah, that's that's a very good point, Ames X David. <laughs> that's probably the correct lesson to to get out of this. Um, <laughs> uh, so, for example, uh, so yeah, EF name. Uh, e 
equals this, and then uh, then we'll use ef name instead of uh, or ef path actually. I guess we'll be a smarter one. And then we'll use ef path instead of etc cetera, etc. Cetera. Yeah. One um. One like general rule of thumb with programming is if you if you wrote the same thing twice. Uh, you probably did something wrong. Uh, so, for example, I had that written out three times. So, in general, it's just better not to uh, to be doing that. Oh, uh, five. Uh, uh, wait, what's the other one? Chase, chase, quick. Yeah. All right, I think we did it. Uh, yay, we saved the town. Yay. <laughs> All right. Uh, cool. So. Uh, yeah, the other thing, like, we could be doing... Actually, I wonder, uh... I wonder what'll happen if, uh... Yeah, so if I... So, binary bot is in, uh... Is in the game, I might as well, uh... I've been play to. Uh, and then... Specifically, I want to see if I get... I know I get a message when someone joins the channel. I want to see if I get a message when someone leaves the channel. Because if someone leaves the channel, I could... I could, I could um... I could remove them from the player data, just so it doesn't get, like, super huge. Player data only has to be as big as, uh... Uh, binrybot is me. Binrybot's my bot. Uh, I, yeah, so, binrybot is, I... Well, so, originally when I, when I was gonna make Journey, I, um... I, I made bi the binrybot account first, and I was gonna use binrybot as the account. But then I was like, uh... But then it occurred to me that I might want to use, uh... I might want to use, uh... I might want to, because because Journeybot is going to take place in its own chat channel, but I might want a bot for my own chat channel, and Binrybot would be a much more sensible name for my own chat channel. Um, so, uh, so I then I made Journeybot as well. So I'm, I have Binrybot as just as an account, and I'm just using it for testing purposes, but I don't. It doesn't actually do anything yet. Uh, oh, cool. Uh, yeah, this this was just going to check. Cause like if you get a part message, then we can just uh, we can just pop that that entry out of the. Uh... Oh, that's weird. Well, I didn't get one just then for. I mean, I should have gotten one for binary bot because binary bot just left. Maybe. Oh. I guess maybe you don't. No, I don't get that. I mean that um. The difference might be that um. That uh. I was only in chat, I wasn't actually viewing the stream, but I don't see how that would make a difference, really. Uh... Uh... <laughs> uh... Oh. Huh. I guess I should also put in a thing where if 60 seconds elapse. Oh, wait, yeah, no, I have an idea. Uh, so if, if event time, if event on. I probably don't have an else for this. Yeah, no, I don't. But uh, I'm going to put in an else, and it's going to be... Uh, Uh, oops, that's too indented. Oh, wait, no, I did already have an else. Oh, no, yeah, I already had an else for that. Wait, what am I, what am I actually trying to do? Else? If event played, yeah. Alright, so yeah, no, I wanted a... Yeah, alright, that was right. Uh, so I wanted an else here. It's because if, if the event hasn't been played, then hypothetically, like, no one... It might have been that no one was in chat when the, uh, when the last, last time the, the, the message got output, so, um... Uh, what do I want to say again? I want to say what we do at setup. We want to say like the intro. So yeah, so, say current event intro and also basically this again. Just uh, so that way, because um, if 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 the intro is said before anyone enters chat, then it might you might get like stuck where like no one. Hey, the lag script. Uh, not a fan of Python, I take it. 
you might you might have come you might uh you might have you might find a little bit of trouble here because we have we have some python experts in the audience uh not me i'm not a python expert at all but uh you might you might find some uh some challengers to that to that stance uh on the plus side the game is working now so like you can like actually like legit play it uh <laughs> here's the link <laughs> so uh so I mean I guess we don't have to worry about that thing that I just did as long as Light Up Man Bot do two is, <laughs> is in the room. But like if Light Up Man Bot two was never was was ever not there, then uh then we'll yeah, we'll just have uh uh yeah, we'll just have it have it basically repeat. <laughs> I was like, what in earth is he saying right now? But, okay. Because uh, I do, I do, like, I don't care about code. I honestly don't care about code. Like, I don't care about computers. I don't care about basically anything. What I care about are, like, end results. And so right now I have an idea for an end result. And so I'm just doing the things that it takes to get to that end result. And coincidentally, it involves computers and code right now. But it doesn't involve C++, it involves Python. So that's why I do what I do at any given time. I, I hope that helps uh, explain my thought process. Um, so I guess I could start doing art now. Pi game, right? Who is it that recommended Pi game? <laughs> it's now your turn to, <laughs> to tell me what I should be doing. Uh, oh, it's frolic time. I'd be so sad if I ever missed a frolic. <laughs> um, Alright, so pie game. How do you, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, tutorial, I suppose. I don't actually want a tutorial, I just want an introduction. <laughs> They're cheat sheet 404s, so cool. Uh, I uh, I usually work in C sharp, or at least that's all my other projects have been written in C sharp. This is, this one we're going rogue. We're we're breaking out. We're doing our own thing. Uh, oh wow! Are all of these going to four hundred four? Because that'd be delightful. No, nope, that one's not four hundred four. It's just not helpful either. <sighs> sprite tutorial, maybe that's four or four. Wow, thanks, Pi Game. <laughs> uh, <laughs> even their docs four or four. This is amazing. Who suggested Pi Game? Who was it? <laughs> uh. Alright, so import pie game, I guess is an important way to start. Oh, and then we have to init pie game. That's doable, All right? Uh, so. Wait, do I have to import that other thing that it listed? Import sys. What is sys? I don't know. Import uh, pie game. Uh, and then apparently I have to. Pie game in it. Huh. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Uh, pie game in it. I, I appreciate that you guys are vested in, uh, programming languages, but like, like I was saying, for me personally, I don't care about the language. I care about the end result, and so I'll literally use. Uh, oh, cool! Seventy-three line. I'm glad to have you here. Yeah, I honestly don't care about the language. I mean, I do kind of care about the language because some things will like irritate me. Oh, oh wow! We have to uh, fires, fires, fires. Yeah, 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 we got it. We got it. Light up man bot too. <laughs> oh, cool! You got him telling time too. Nice. Um, what are my stats? How well am I doing in this game? I have six points. I'm not doing very well, but whatever. Uh, Alright, cool. 
Uh, so size. Are these just like general? Wait, what? Oh, we're just declaring these up front. All right, so apparently we have size, speed, and black. All right, so we have to we have to make a screen, which is a display dot set mode size. Uh, I don't know what we want for size. Oh wait, no, I do kind of know what we want for size. How big is uh? How big is a uh, Game Boy Advance? Game Boy Advance uh, screen resolution. I'm, I was thinking Game Boy Advance would probably be a uh, a good uh, a good like size for our for this like it'll it'll take up a chunk somewhere on screen. So like this. It'll basically like it'll probably take up a chunk about like this big uh, somewhere on my screen, uh, and yeah, I'm thinking a Game Boy Advance is probably like a pretty good. Uh, uh, resolution. All right, two forty by one sixty. All right. Uh. So yeah, what was it? How do we init the screen? Uh. Uh, right, so pygame game uh, screen equals screen equals uh, uh, we might want to do some of those calculation -y things on a separate thread so that our screen render because like we're, I don't know I don't know I don't know what that time will be the timing for some of that stuff it seems like it could get kind of kind of long if it um, if it uh, if there were a lot of users, hypothetically. Um, I won't worry about that yet, though. Uh, so... Oh, yeah, sorry, I'll start moving this around. Oh, God, I did not mean to do that. No, stop. Stop doing that. It's annoying, and I don't intend that. Stop. No! <laughs> Weird. Alright. <laughs> Uh, uh, yeah, so the screen thing. Uh, Pi game display set mode. So, uh, we should do this. I guess, like, I guess down here. I'll do it after the events, because that's kind of like the upper block. Uh, so X to I don't remember what that is. I'll do it. Okay. So uh, so graphics equals pi game dot screen. Where was it? <laughs> uh, pi game dot display dot set mode. Uh, pi game dot display dot set mode. So, uh, I mean, I guess I could just use that format. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's probably not super important. So, uh, width, uh, width equals, uh, what did we say the Game Boy size was? Uh, 240 by 160, so let's say, uh, Yeah, I mean, I, hmm. uh, huh. Yeah, I'll, uh, 
let's go like 480 uh, height equals, uh, where was it, 1160, so 320. Um, set mode width height. And actually, I should do uh, like uh, just so I know what width height I'm talking about. Uh, all right, so say that. Um, what else do I need to do in order to set up a uh, a game? So I need a uh, so some about ball because presumably I want to draw. Uh, excuse me. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> presumably I want to draw things at some point. It's a reasonable assertion. Uh, I actually want to draw a lot of things, so that'll be fun. Um, so, uh, huh, I wonder if, uh, I wonder if I can do text in Pygame, or if I have to do that, um, if I have to make actual images for, for Py, for, for text. I mean, I guess that's not going to be a super big deal either way. Um, hold on, I'm just going to take out, not earbuds, uh, pardon. So, uh, yeah, um, alright, so, yeah, I'll probably want to render stuff eventually, but I guess the main loop is that, um, while we're looping, huh, oh, uh, yeah, that seems important, I guess, in case we want to quit, that seems important. Uh, sure. Right. I don't know. Why not? Uh. So. So for event in pi game dot event. Wait. What is it? How did it go? Uh, pygame dot event dot get pygame dot event dot get uh was it if uh if event equals what is it if event equals pygame dot quit so, oh that's where you have sys alright so that's sys, I guess. Import sys. Uh, event equals pi game dot quit. Uh, then we sys. What was it? What's the sys command dot exit? I think. Sys, uh, yeah. Maybe. Something like that. Uh, seems practical. Um, well, I might not want that. I might not want to accidentally click that. I assume that means like when you click the X button, it close, it shuts things down. But um, I might not necessarily want that to be the case. Slide about still farming. Uh, oh no. <laughs> uh, Do another stuff. It's over. You can come out now. <laughs> oh right, because I didn't. Uh, I guess that's good because it wasn't spamming. <laughs> um, so yeah, so so ball rack, etc. etc. Ball rack, etc. etc. Ball rack, etc. etc. Screen dot fill. Oh yeah, black and then blit ball ball rack. I mean flip, I guess is the important part. Pygame dot display dot flip. Uh, so uh, pygame dot uh, what? Display dot flip.
So I guess for now we can just do graphics dot fill uh, it was just a fill, yeah. So we'll just have a black square, presumably. Alright. Uh, could you program in lifelike human intelligence for it to carry on a conversation? That's, that's one thing you could do with a chatbot, right? That might be a bit out of scope, though. I'm I am just jo I'm just joking about that. What? No module named Pygame. Well, that's well, that's something. <laughs> How is there no module named Pygame? Did I not install Pygame? I assumed I did. I downloaded the installer. Hmm. Maybe it didn't. Uh. <laughs> Let me know how that goes. <laughs> oh, good job! Congratulations. <laughs> I knew you could do it. Uh, oh no, it's totally installed. Uh, no. I guess repair it then. Are you installing it somewhere dumb? Is that what you're doing? Hmm. Yeah, it definitely doesn't. <laughs> uh. Doop -doop -doop. Yeah, I don't. I've never used Pygame before, so. I don't know. Maybe I installed it incorrectly. Seems weird, but whatever. I'm looking for programs. Programs and features. Uh, Pi game. Wait, you're not even going to show up on this list? Well, that might be an example of why. Uh, <laughs> Yay! <laughs> um, Pygame doesn't realize that it's installed right now. That's weird. I'll try uninstalling it from... That was one of the options in the installer, right? I could uninstall it. Uh, yeah. Sure. Install for all users, sure. Python 2.7 from registry seems like it would be the, uh, the easy one, but uh, I guess I can just do it from, I can specify the location, I guess. Uh, so, yeah. Python 2.7. Oh, did I, I guess I just scrolled right past it. Thank you, Edge <laughs> Um Alright, so yeah, where is my Python installed? Because I'm pretty sure it's not the thing that it's saying right there. D program files, Anaconda. No. Is this it? Oh, Py is this it? I don't know. <laughs> I guess let's try that one for starters, why not? <laughs> I like that it, uh, I like that it, I like, I like when chat interjects smiley faces in <laughs> places that you didn't necessarily <laughs> intend them. Uh, Oh no, the human intelligence didn't work. Um, that's okay, humans aren't that special anyways. Why no module pie game, bruh? 
Is this secretly not the Python that I'm using? Is it secretly a different one because of my Anaconda installation? Uh, try pointing it over here, maybe? I don't know if that's going to make a difference, but yeah, it could be. I just have it installed twice. Something, because I did install it before installing Anaconda, so. Uh, stranger things, I guess, have happened. Uh, sorry, so <laughs> it'd be nice if I could just uh, not have to remove it, but anyways. Uh, let's try this one. See if that doesn't work. Nope. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> I'm just gonna try restarting, cause like. Sometimes restarting stuff just helps, for whatever reason. And other times it doesn't. Unfortunately, restarting spider takes a minute. Oh no, that doesn't take long at all. Still no module named Pygame. So that's dumb. So maybe screw Pygame, and I don't care, and screw Pygame. <laughs> um... Weird. Well, considering how many, uh, considering how many, um, of those pages 404'd, I wouldn't be surprised if the one that we, we, uh, I didn't see a manual installation option, actually. Um, sorry, my phone just made a noise. I'm not. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't see a more manual installation than, uh, than what I had there, but, um, hmm, well, yeah, I'll see, I'll see what it put, where it put, where I told it to put stuff, um, oops, that's not right, oh, what am I doing, <laughs> okay, uh, so I put it in the anaconda, what is it even putting here? Oh, I hate searching. <sighs> Window searching is the worst thing. No items match my search. Great. Great. Uh, it would be in lib site packages, you say? Survey says... Nope. That's weird. So, probably, more likely than not, screw Pygame, I don't care about it, will be the dramatic conclusion to the series of events. Um, I'm just going to remove it. Because it doesn't even appear to be installing anything, so... I don't know. This is weird. Or I guess it could have been named something weird, but... Either way, I don't totally care about it right now. So, let's try and find something that works instead. Uh, so, Python... We really... We don't need anything super crazy. We just need, um... We just need a way to, like, uh... Basically just, like, render images. Um, so, how about, uh... I don't know. I would hope that there'd be more than one way to just do that in Python. But, uh... Well, yeah, I don't know. Did you ever encounter stuff, weird stuff like that when you were setting up Pygame? Like, I don't have anything against it, except for the fact that it doesn't work. <laughs> um, so, uh... Oh, yeah, I should get rid of, uh... those things I added. <laughs> which reference Pygame. Uh... Yeah, right? Hmm. Okay. 
Yes, times certainly seem to change around uh, Pygame, considering uh, how many of his links for a forward. So... I don't know, like py Python Sprite? Something? Oh, is there just a... Oh, god damn it. <laughs> I mean, sorry, gosh darn it. Uh, I don't care about Pygame. No one cares about Pygame. I installed Python weird. <laughs> Alright, well, considering I installed it in a folder on my computer, that's pretty freaking valid to me. So if Pygame can't handle that, then no offense, Pygame's a little bit... Again, I I put effort into making my um, projects accommodate like really just super obvious stuff. So uh, I also appreciate it when um, other developers do the same. Python graphics library. Sure. Sounds fine. Hmm. That was a short list. Wouldn't it be neat if the installer did that? <laughs> Wouldn't that be neat if the installer just did that? What do installers do anyways? Isn't it stuff like that, I feel like? I don't know. Isn't, isn't that exactly the point of having an installer in the first place? I don't know. Interesting. Um... <laughs> ISFML. I like as I like how it has FML in it. What is Pi SFML? Let's find out. I tried both the um, Python default installation and Anaconda, so I really can't care about either of those things. And Anaconda, like, seems to... Well, I have better... I mean, I have other options, so, like, if those things wanted <laughs> to get used, they... I don't know, maybe shouldn't suck as much? Just throwing stuff out there, I don't know. Um... <laughs> Where's SFML? I honestly can't care. Like, I, I don't think you guys are lying when you say that it can work for you. But it doesn't, it really, like, whether something can work for one person is one thing. Whether something will work for most or all people is the relevant thing right now. Uh, and not even for all people, but just, like, me in particular. And it doesn't, so... It's neat that you guys are having success, so, like, good luck to you guys. <laughs> um. I 
Yeah, what on earth is SFML? Everything talks about it as if I should know that already. So, or what is SFML? Um. <laughs> I, um, simple and fast multimedia library, apparently. Sounds legit. Uh, what is the license for it? Seems like a cool license. Yeah, but Pi dot or Pi SFML has a Pi wrapper, so or Pi binding, so seems legit. Why would I need other languages? <laughs> I thought Python was supposed to be cool, Joe. Or Ames X David. I, uh, I was under the impression that there were actually supposed to be benefits to using this. <laughs> um, so, uh, alright. So this seems... Nah, I don't know. Uh, so, download, I guess. Wait, let's, let's, let's see if it actually does the things that I would hope for it to do. <laughs> Alright, that makes sense. <laughs> Pip. That'd be neat, I guess. Um, API reference, I guess. Yeah, sounds good. So... I mean, really, I'm probably just going to make, like, pings or, like, gifs or whatever for, um, for the sprites, and then, as, so as long as we can, uh, <laughs> yeah, let it, man, I believe in you, um, so yeah, as long as this can do, like, as long as this can, like, open, open my image files and render them, then, uh, That's all we need. Alright. Uh hmm. let's check it out the no wait, where did I go? Uh I'm gonna close these things for a minute. Uh, where was I? It's like, uh... Uh... <laughs> what a texture. Whoa, what was that all about? A oh, huge texture. <laughs> cool. Lion, thank you for uh, thank you for tuning in. I uh, yeah, I mean, I hope something exists that installs correctly. That would be that'd be pretty sweet, right? Uh, anyways, it's it nice to have you around. So I uh, I hope to see you again sometime in the in the near future. Um, I uh, I was planning on streaming for a while today, but I don't know. We got a lot done, too, right? The bot, like, does stuff, right? So, like, wait, what are we... Oh, yeah, the bot's not running right now. I guess I could run the bot again. Why not? Uh, the bot, like... I don't know. Like, 
really, we just need to do like art and then a lot of uh, content design at this point. So that's kind of cool. Uh, <laughs> all right. Well, how about um, I probably I'll probably yeah I'll probably see if I can I'll see if I can get art started because like once we get art up and running, then then from there it's basically like tuning, of course, because it's not everything's not going to work right up front. Oh, and then there's like. Because there's a delay on the stream, like, it takes, uh, you know, once, um, like, with chat, it's instantaneous, so the bot, like, says stuff, and it happens instantly. Since on the stream, it's delayed, like, there's, like, I don't know how long is the delay, I think it's, like, 20 seconds or something between, uh, between, at least, like, 20 seconds between, like, when an image displays on screen and when it, um, when it, uh, when, like, the, or excuse me, when, uh, when I actually, like, Right, so y you understand how delay works. Uh, so um, I think uh, I think yeah. So I'm I want to set it so that there are actually going to be two active events at any given time. Um, the uh, or like okay, so no, there'll be one active event at any given time, but the the previous active event, like whatever event just happened, you can continue to vote on it, and you'll still get credit for it, even after that one ends. Um, so that way even if like you're suffering from like a long delay you can still participate in the game i mean like the the, the consequences will actually already get determined in advance um so uh so like your vote won't be part of the calculation and i might make it so that you don't get bonus points because otherwise people could just wait until after the after the result and like kind of game the system that way um but i'll i'll uh yeah, I, I, that way, so yeah, that way, um, with the significant duration of the, um, of the actual, uh, events themselves, and then with the, um, with that added, like, you know, extra, extra time extension, uh, then even just with the, the visuals coming through the, um, through the, the, the stream rather than through chat, I'm, I'm thinking it, the game will, should still be playable, um, and, uh, yeah, so that's not going to be automatic, though. I'm going to have to go through and actually set that up. So that's another thing that we'll have to do before... So it's not literally just content design at this point. But uh, we're, we're actually... I mean... Uh, yeah, so it's, I guess it's like... It's that, it's content design. And then um, trying to get this running on the web, I guess, will be another big thing. Yeah, no, and actually I do have other big features that I want to put in. Like, I want to make it so that... Like, I have a, an idea for, like like a narrative overarching story so it's not just like a sequence of events that that come up like the the pool of events will be there because that's like the bread and butter sort of thing but um but then uh, i want to um i want to uh but add, add in like other like uh just cool stuff it's not it's not core though i mean like i can uh i can just uh I can just oh yeah the bot's gonna the, I put in that thing where the bot will like repeat itself if uh when people if when people don't answer so uh I think I did or, I mean I think it should work but, oh wait whoa, we got an error what oops bot down bot down that knows uh yeah what hold on what error did we get uh two eighteen What? 218. Uh, what? How is this file not open for writing? We just freaking opened this file for writing. That's ridiculous. Yeah, I don't, I do not accept that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, sorry about that, Light man. We we hit an error, and I don't know what that was about. Um, Alright, so let's try this again. Uh, <laughs> how on earth could the file not be open if we're only, if we're only performing this with file open? How on earth? How on earth? Maybe, 
Yeah, no, I have no clue. Maybe it'll just work this time. Yeah. Please just work. <laughs> Do something. Oh gosh, the delay takes so long. If you... If you're being serious right now, I'm going to flip out. Because for one thing, like... Oh wait, did I need to put that W thing in it? Wait, no. Wait, yeah, where'd the comma W go? Is that what we needed to do? Uh... <laughs> yeah, what happened to the thing about... I remember there was like a comma... Open quotations, W, close quotations, but... I don't remember what happened to it. Uh, I might have deleted it when I was, uh... When I was converting E, F path. I assume that was the case. It went here, right? This is how it went, right? I assume this is how it went. Whatever. This is how it's going now. Uh, oh wait, no, it doesn't go there, right? No, it goes uh, It goes in the other two cases. Is that what it was? Oh yeah, alright. Cool! I guessed correctly! <laughs> it's almost as if I'm learning. <laughs> it's This is reminiscent of learning, isn't it? Alright, so now hopefully the bot will work. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I'm going to leave the bot to run for a minute, and I'm also going to refill my water bottle. I will be, I will be back just shortly. Super shortly. I'm almost back already. That's how short it is. Uh, I forgot to put the, uh, the water bottle doggy back up. Ah, uh, what? What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just the writing one. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, all right, so now the bot should actually work. Maybe I don't know. I'm gonna stop saying that at this point. It'll work when it decides to work. Uh, <laughs>
Thank you, Amzex David. I might have figured that out. Uh, <laughs> uh, it probably would take me a little while to figure that one out, actually. <laughs> so thank you. Um, so, yeah, let's continue looking at this, like, PFW, ML, whatever. Uh, <laughs> SFML. <laughs> Sorry, I just, that, that abbreviation amuses me. Alright, so, uh, yeah, I wonder, I wonder how, uh, I just want to see it, like, I just want to see it legit work, right? Or, like, I want to see, like, a legit example of, like, how this works. Um, did you, did you, er no errors yet. It's just still taking a sweet time. What? <laughs> Where are all these errors coming from? We didn't used to have errors like these. Uh... Hmm. So one of the files got screwed up? I guess that would be believable, considering all the errors we ran into. Uh, projects. Journey. Players. Was it me? Well, that's weird, for one thing. Um, I'll start myself back at zero. Or no, I'll just delete my file. Alright, so I might have lost some data. Sorry. It's probably a light up, man. Oh no, Letterman's still good. Letterman bot. Maybe it's just me. Alright, so yeah. Maybe because I'm alphabetically superior, I took the bullet on that one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, cool. Alright, I took the bullet. My score is back at zero. Or maybe it'll work now. Uh, oh, alright. Alright. <laughs> well, I guess, uh, yeah. <laughs> your bot is pretty cool huh did you hard code in what the options are or is he actually like rocking the uh the options from uh from like the from the text um <laughs> alright so my score is back at zero alright stats yeah, current XP of Binry is zero. Oh well. I'm a noob. That's what I get for making all those errors. I got demoted all the way back down to noob. Um, so yeah, the one thing that all these examples are not doing, or like the one thing I haven't seen any of the examples do, is actually load a texture. It's like, please do that. <laughs> um... Because I want to make textures, and I want... Uh, okay, yeah. I mean, yeah, because the other thing, like, uh, once I get back to content design, is that um, there are going to be a lot more events. Like, it's going to... They're the, they're the different types of events. There's, like, event zero, where anything goes. There's event one, where you, like, pick and choose. Or, like, you know, it's better just to choose one for, the, for everyone to choose the same option. And there's going to be events, like, two and three. And I might even add more event types, but then I also want to add more events of each type, so... So that way, it, like, it feels like, like more like a, a well-rounded journey, rather than just, like, uh, <laughs> like, goblin burning villages connected by, uh, bridges and meadows. Um. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um... Uh, so, alright, so, pi sfml, uh, load texture. Or, fine, just sfml. No, I should... Man. Wow, 
did not like that. Apparently not many people use Pi SFML. Uh, Pi SFML. Uh, texture. I guess it would be like open texture. Maybe. Uh, this is what I was just looking at. Uh, oh wait. Was there anything? Loading resources. Uh, no. <sighs> um, so we call this ah life, life and stuff and whatnot. Uh, all right, just for fun, I want to see where Pi game ended up because it definitely didn't end up where I told it to, it would, it should end up. It just like went some random place, right? Because like I looked in the place where I told it to go, and there was nothing there. So, uh, yeah, no. Or I don't know, whatever. I'll leave that lit. <laughs> so wait, what was this one? This is like the D anaconda. That was anaconda. Yeah. Like that, basically. Uh, sure, have a boss. Alright, so now where did you actually end up? Because you didn't end up in here, right? If I, if I looked for Pygame in here, or no, I looked in the subfolder, but I looked in the subfolder, CP1414 told me to look in. Yeah, no items in my search. So where the heck did it end up? I'm gonna take a shot in the dark and say it ended up on the C drive for some dumb reason. No. I don't know. Well, I'll look for Pi game in the backgrounds while, uh, while other stuff, etc., etc. Uh, because if it's really, if it's as simple as just, like, moving it to the ground folder, <laughs> that sounds a lot simpler than, like, the rest of this other stuff that we're looking up here. Uh, I just, I really appreciate that this, uh, this acronym has FML in it. I just really appreciate that. I really can't emphasize that enough. Um, oh, did, did we find something? Hey, look at that. We found stuff. C program files x86. Anaconda. <laughs> Not even close, bruh. Not even close. Although, why the heck is... Yeah, no. I don't even care. Uh, what is Pi Charm? I guess I can find that out by looking it up. Uh, I don't necessarily trust it any more than I... I mean, like, I don't know. I have no specific reason to assume that it'll work, but... Or that it won't work. I just... I just at this point, I don't really feel like I have any specific reason to assume that it will work. Um, Alright, so... Nah, I'm just gonna... Just gonna slam it. Because <laughs> I'm guessing there's probably nothing else in that folder. I probably just made up this fake anaconda folder and uh, and just invented itself there. Yep. I'm almost certain that that's the case. Yep, look at that. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, I say. Alright, but on the plus side, maybe this will actually work. Uh, oh, so I should bring back those things that I got rid of. So all of it, and then I have to, I have to fix that thing that I did with, uh, with the W. Uh, I mean, I'm getting a little ahead of myself thinking that Pi Charm. Oh no, I don't, I don't, I'm not looking for a new IDE, but thank you. Uh, where was that? It was in the. Uh, yeah, it was in this part. So, in this case, W. Yeah. Pretty sure that's correct. Whoop. Whoop. Wrong, wrong keystrokes. Or wrong computer. <laughs> Save. Uh, Alright, so. So now let's move it to the correct folder and hope it just works. <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? 
Alright, so this was Anaconda include. Yeah. And then, uh, what was the other thing? Lib. Oh yeah, this was the place that, uh, what was it, site packages? This is the place that CP1414 said. Uh, yeah, no, I, that, this clearly had nothing to do with Anaconda, or like, I don't know, nothing about this makes me think Anaconda was the problem. I'm pretty sure Pygame just like, spazzed out and went to the wrong location, so... I have no reason to think that PyCharm would have been any better about that. Um, site packages. Alright. Well, hopefully that'll just work now. And this isn't a real thing, so... I'll just have to remember how to just delete PyGame if I want to delete PyGame. Uh, if I want to uninstall it. <clears throat> yeah, let it man buy it. You got some stats going on. Oh, we're in the meadow. Uh, flowers. Flowers are fun. Many bouquets were picked, or something like that. Uh, I'm gonna jinx it though. It's gonna error out now that, now that I did that. Uh, <laughs> uh, right. But I could actually just restart the. Many lovely bouquets were made. All right. Uh, so I'm gonna try restarting the bot now. E no. Yes. Kill the old process. What? Huh. Well, that's a different error. So that could be. That could be good. Uh, import pygame file d. Wait. Oh right. Yeah. No. Right. Yeah. Okay. So d program files. And the website package is pied. What? Percent one is not a valid Win32 application. Sure, why not? I, I, uh, you are you are always a pleasure, always very helpful, and uh, and fun to have around. So, yeah. Nothing could change that. Well, some things could, but I don't think you. I don't think you would ever do the things that that could change that. What is up with this? DLL load failed. Who said percent one was a valid one thirty two application in the first place? All right. Now I'll probably just. I'll probably just forget Pi. Game. I mean, it'd be. I really. It'd really. It'd be really convenient if it just freaking worked, since, um, since apparently, like, people love it, and it's really helpful and stuff, but, like, it just doesn't want to, just doesn't want to right now, so, what's up with that? I was looking for Pygame in it. Oh. Oh. Hmm. They're doing some stupid stuff in here, bruh. Bruh. Yeah, what was the error? Uh, line 95. 95 from pygame.base import what's the problem there? DLL load failed percent one is not valid 132 application what the what, the what? alright I, I believe that. You are literally a peach. <laughs> um, Alright, yeah, no, this is just dumb. Pi game is dumb.
turbo dumb, I would say. Like, dumb at the speed of light. Um. So, oh my gosh, it was special. <laughs> Sorry, I'll try and be more interesting and, so, and not just uh, muck around with this dumb stuff, which is, in my defense, turbo dumb. This stuff is dumb at the speed of light, but, uh, but no, I should, that's no excuse to continue mucking around with it, so, alright, yeah, get rid of that stuff junk. Meaningless junk. Uh, so, uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I just, I don't think debugging is very fun. Like, I just assume that, um, <laughs> all right, well, thank you, Lighter Man. I, um, yeah, I just, I don't know. I wish I were actually a accomplishing something instead of just, like, not. Because, like, right now, I don't know. I just feel, I feel like, maybe maybe it's just me. I just feel, like, so stagnant and so un unaccomplished right now. So, I would like for that to change. I would like to accomplish something. And I mean, I guess I should probably just assume that SFML will work in some manner. I don't know. How do... So... It would just be really convenient if, if SFML proved its capability of just, like, loading a file. Or, like, just opening a file. Or just rendering a file that has been opened. That'd be really useful to me. Uh, <laughs> um, Alright, I guess I'll just... <laughs> There's plenty of binary to go around. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. Alright, so, uh... Representation of a texture. It's not transformable. It's so drawable. Base class for objects can be drawn to render target. Drawable is a very simple base class that allows objects of drive class to be drawn on a render target. All you have to do in your drive class is over at the drive. Blah, 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 blah. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Sprite's drawable class is in the Who, what weirdo generates their own sprites programmatically at runtime? Oh, not, not anyone is the answer to that question. Why would you use that as your example? That's the worst example. It just makes me think that it can't, which is probably super turbo dumb because of course it has to be able to do that because otherwise it's basically ridiculous. All right, I'm exaggerating slightly, but um, no, but like, It, I don't know. I feel like it really should. Like, if it doesn't hold itself to that standard, like, what? <laughs> no, I, I understand there are probably purposes for, for, for other things, but, like, I, uh, I'm not enthusiastic about them, I guess. Um, so...
I blame Pi Game for this also. I blame Pi Game for all the ills of the world. Oh, this one can do text, so that's cool. <laughs> um, so, I guess, uh, I'll just look to Python for a second. It's cause like, so like for, for sprites and stuff. No, it doesn't like sprite. So for like, uh, texture, I guess. No, it doesn't like texture. Uh, for like, ping? Email? No. Image HDR. Uh, so, I feel like editing my registry right now, which is probably not a good instinct, because I feel like, like, Pygame clearly has, like, its head screwed on backwards, and, like, I feel like, <laughs> uh, no, experience is gonna be just cumulative, um, and, uh, I want to do more with it than just have a numerical representation, but, um, I don't know, I could add, like, gold or something for you to spend. Um, yeah, there's no specific reason you couldn't do that. It wouldn't, uh, it would be weird to do it during the stream, though, I guess. Like, once I have a website set up to, uh, for, like, a character page, maybe I would add it, like, somewhere like that, I guess. Um... Uh, <laughs> so, I should probably just, um, I've been postponing, I'm gonna roll back to Windows 7, I think. I think I'm on Windows 8. Is this Windows 8? Is Windows 8 the one that does this? I think I'm on Windows 8. And I've been, I've been meaning to roll, just, just roll back to Windows 7, because I don't remember it being this bad. Um, so I should, maybe I should just do that. I'm so not into this right now. I kind of want to just like, I don't know. I uh, <laughs> I just want to get over this like hump. Wouldn't that be fantastic? Uh, and then in order to do that, like I really don't know what to accomplish, so or like how to accomplish that, so. Like legit, if like Pygame wanted to like work, I would be all on board with that, but like, you, you saw the, you saw like the latest of errors, right? Like, I, if I, I like, I keep, because I can't think of anything else to do, so like, I keep thinking of Pi Game, and I'm literally at the point where I'm thinking like, I should edit my registry, and I don't think that is the, <laughs> I don't think that's actually a good thing to think, necessarily. I, I mean, unless you're, unless you're suggesting I edit my registry, then, um, I, I don't see that as a valuable option. I'd love for it to be a viable option. I just don't see it as that, so. Uh, maybe I should just go on, like, Twitter for a while. And, uh, is that, <laughs> is that cool? I'm just gonna, <laughs> no. I, I don't like being boring on camera, so I will refrain. I did just check that I have, like, a jazillion emails, but I won't actually read what they are. Not right now. Uh... So, yeah, so, Windows 7 would be cool. <laughs> I know it shouldn't be necessary, but, like, I, a lot of that's on Pi Game. <laughs> like, if they wanted to make a less lame product, then that would be their prerogative. But they didn't. They made what's apparently a fine product. 
apparently at this like level of quality it's a fine product but uh unfortunately this level of quality precludes me from using it right now so uh so yeah all right let's just start editing the registry right let's just like <laughs> i mean if it's just pie game then like <laughs> let's at least look uh <laughs> um so, where would this even be? <laughs> uh, Pi game, reg, just reg edit. Uh, it's not under software, I guess. Fine. You freaking anaconda haters! Like, um, once it once it's thoroughly proven that like anaconda has nothing to do with any of this stuff uh uh wait, wait hold on wait um i expect yeah so i expect everyone for the rest of the night to listen to uh listen to um <laughs> Nicki Minaj's anaconda on loop really loudly no headphones speakers speakers only uh i don't even what it? I don't. Was yeah. So what am I doing? I'm like opening a command prompt, like a caveman for some reason. Uh, loading Python. I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, loading Python in a command prompt. Yeah, I don't know what that even means. I mean, I probably should. You probably covered that in your course, but uh, oh, that's simple enough. Uh, and then, uh, import Pygame. Womp. Yeah, that's the same error that we were getting in, uh, in Anaconda, so. Uh, it should load in that window, I agree. But it's, it's, like, ridiculously dumb, so. <laughs> uh, I want to do a marathon, but actually at this point I'm probably just gonna, like, I think it, it just seems more likely that we should just close up shop. I just, like, because, like, I don't, I mean, I appreciate that you're all here, but, like, I honestly don't understand why you're Because, <laughs> like, if I was watching this stream, I would have bailed, like, right when everything was so, so bad and so, just so ridiculously bad. Oh, so for anyone playing along at home, Anaconda was not the problem. I expect you all to be listening to Anaconda, Nicki Minaj's Anaconda on loop for the rest of the night. No speaker, or no headphones, speakers only. Volume loud. Loud enough that people complain. When people complain, you can turn it down slightly, but don't turn it down enough that they're actually happy. Turn it down only enough that they stop complaining, not that they're actually happy. All right? All of you guys. I, I expect all of you guys to be doing that. Um, yeah. Uh, so... Maybe I'll just play the bot for the rest of the night. Flowers... Uh, <laughs> that's a nice thought, but it's 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 a nice thought, but uh, you're you're very off base. The way that I might be quick too quick to blame Pi Game, which I'm not, I'm actually correct. Uh, I think you're a bit too quick to to blame Anaconda. Uh, you should use it. It's actually probably better than whatever Python stuff you're using. I actually have no clue if that's true, but no, I just I'm I'm confident that it's actually a fine product, and I mean. Like how how many data points do you need that it's Pygame before 
or like that it's not anaconda before you realize that it's not anaconda because i can i mean I, i'm not really doing much else right now so i might as well just give you all the data points you need in order to convince you that it's not anaconda because it's not anaconda and you guys better be playing that on loop mickey Minaj's anaconda let me know if you need the link to it uh i and actually i didn't specify this up front but i'm gonna say it has to be the music video too and the music video has to be like take full screen on your second monitor so yep chop chop <laughs> <laughs> Let me know if you need the link. Um, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I, I just want to look. I want I want to install Windows Seven right now, but in order to do that, I need a uh, I need a DVD to like do a system recovery, whatever, whatever, and uh, yeah. Oh, sorry, I thought you were talking about uh, Journey. Yeah, Journey, Journey, like, these are the the events that we have in there are just, like, the fodder. Like, these are the things that, like, you encounter, like, randomly through the course of the journey. But, um, yeah, the, so the, the plans for the, the actual, like, story elements are, are going to have, like, a greater, like, overarching narrative sort of thing where, like, you, you know, you're actually, you're journeying for a purpose and, like, you have, you actually, like, reach, like, like mini bosses and then like you know these grand events and stuff so uh yeah i mean i mean i guess we could i guess i could start going in that direction since uh since i'm only really blocked on the art right now um to the registry Wait, what? Red Dead, right? Those are, yeah, Red Dead. Uh, 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 what am I looking for? I don't, I actually don't know. System. Mm. Uh, <laughs> no. I just thought it'd be in software. Installed option. Where the heck is? Well, so obviously I don't know what I'm doing here, so I probably shouldn't be changing things here. But I was kind of hoping I would find. Uh... Oh, maybe it's not on local machine. I should not change anything here. I'm just looking. Sorry, I'm just looking. Oh, uh, yeah, what's this about? What's all this then? Python. Oh. I think for Pi game. Um, yeah, I should, uh, I should find out what I'm trying to do in here. Uh, <laughs> um, alright, so. Hi game registry settings. Dot MIDI. Registry won't show. No, what I should do. First visit here. That is numpy. <laughs> Sweet. Um registry <laughs> keys sure. It's gonna be four or four, no. This is actually gonna be Oh. Alright. Port MIDI. What what? What are you talking about? Oh. No. Useless.
Uh, hmm. So... Um, Alright, so yeah, no, I just have to get over that Pi game is as dumb as advertised and a dead end. Alright, and then I can, then I can move in the, start moving in the right direction. I don't know if that, if the correct direction is FML, but let's give FML a shot. Because <laughs> FML, <laughs> sorry, that's technically inappropriate, so I've, I'll stop saying that. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, cool. Hey, look, I even found the thing that I was looking for. Where you can create an image from an image file. Yay! <laughs> it's a sign, maybe. Or it's just a coincidence. Um, either way. Uh, it's a screw pie game. Pie game. Pie lame. <laughs> Eat it. Uh, <laughs> uh, brag about it. <laughs> uh, remove pie game. Which probably won't work very well because. Uh, whatever. Well, to each their own. Uh, oh, I really want to get rid of that stupid stupid pie game and it's insufferable. <laughs> uh, I'm just really annoyed. Pie game owes me an hour of my life. Specifically the one that just elapsed. It, it, it owes all of you an hour of your life. It's a horrible, horrible thing. <laughs> I shouldn't be so negative about it because like I mean, like, I'm probably not better at programming software for PC or anything, but, uh, I guess the real lesson here is that stuff's complex, and, uh, and sometimes that sucks. Alright, so, site packages, and then what was the other one? It was, like, include, maybe? Yeah, Pi game. And then there's another Pi... I probably don't care at this point. Oh, we probably added relatively recently, right? So... I don't know what it is. Uh... was it in? Was it in, uh... was it lib? Say... lib... say packages... It should have a different date modified than the others, right? 1014, no? Eh. Yeah, whatever. I stopped caring. Uh, alright. Uh. Huh. Well, I think we all know how I feel about mastery. Overrated. Jump in as soon as you feel like you want to jump in. If you have any inclination to jump in, jump in. That's clearly how I do it. Uh, Alright, so yeah. I was really hoping you would not have an automatic installer. Alright. <laughs> uh, Pi 2.7. 64 bit? Which is the normal one? Which one's the weird one? I forget. I'll try this one. Ugh. Ugh. 
Alright, hold on. I really wish I could find more interest information on this. Because I really don't feel like... There's, like, so little about this. Like, I don't even have a strong sense of, like, how how good this software is. Like, Pi Game, I, I just... There was enough, like, recommendations that I was, like, comfortable... I would have been comfortable installing that, I think. But, like... With this, it's, like... I don't... This is, like, more of a shot in the dark. I, uh... I really freaking want to install Windows 7 right now. So, I might just go to the store, get a DVD... ROM... Or DVD... DVD... Or DVD writable. Or, yeah, whatever it's called. And then, uh... And then just do that instead. So... <laughs> uh... Yeah, that sucks. Uh, sucks for you guys, so I'm sorry, but if it's any consolation, it also sucks for me, so... Um, let's see, maybe there'll be someone online who's cool, and then uh, I'll probably kick it over to... Uh, yeah, I'm probably going to kick it over to uh, Joe Creates. He... Uh, he makes cool werewolf sprite art. At least he has been lately. Let's see what he's doing. Uh, he doesn't. Um, he doesn't talk much on stream, but oh, I was going to show a commercial. Um, he doesn't talk much on stream. At least not usually. But uh, he. Um, I don't know. He just makes really cool art. So I'm probably going to kick it over to him. And maybe I'll. Like maybe if I get my comp my OS sorted out, then maybe I'll. Uh, I'll stream again later, but I'm not certain. I don't, I don't know how this is gonna go. So I can't make any promises. But uh, I, because life sucks and I hate everything. <laughs> That's why I'm going offline. Uh, no, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna go to the store and I'm gonna get a DVD writable, and then I'm going to reinstall my operating system, and then I'm going to. Hopefully you get Pi Game to work. <laughs> uh, I'm literally going to do that. So if you have, if the, if you if you mean that I should actually wait, then uh, now is the time to to speak or forever hold your peace. Um, and uh, yeah, we're gonna kick it over to to Joe Creates now. So I'm not gone forever. I'll, if I'm not back tonight, I'll be back tomorrow. But. Um, yeah, I mean, we've, we've wasted so much time that this is just, like, I'm legit frustrated right now. I'm just, like, I'm not in a, I'm not in a good mood, so, um, so, let's, le let's, let's look at, no, don't tell me what to do. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm gonna kick it over that way. Um, thank you everyone for, for tuning in. Um, I might be back soon, more likely than not, I'll be back tomorrow, and, uh, it is, uh, we got a lot done today. I don't care about this stupid pie game stuff, because we got a lot done regardless, and, uh, I, I don't know. That, that was cool. I, um, I won't shut down the bot immediately when I, when I log off, but I, I will be shutting off soon. So, yeah, thank you for everyone for tuning in. Uh, if you'd like, <laughs> I'm not even, there's a follow button, and you can follow me on Twitter and everything, but I'm not even gonna bother plugging it, because, like, frankly, Frankly, this stream sucked, and I'm sorry. So, uh, yeah, hopefully we'll have something better going on in the future. But, um, yeah, instead, uh, now let's go watch uh, werewolves eat people. Um, and I hope to see you, I hope to see you all again soon. Uh, thank you, and good night.